Hi folks, Calc here, and in this series of videos we're going to look at the more experimentational side of both the peak and the circuit monostation synthesizers. This particular video is quite an interesting hack. We can actually use the CV input on peak and actually get audio passing through the peak's effects and the filter. It's quite an unusual approach and very experimental. Um, one thing to say is that the sound that we get is quite unusual, um, but I think it should give you an idea and a flavour of the sorts of things that you can do with the synth. Basically what I'm doing is I'm taking um, an Amen break, of course, why would you use anything else? And I'm sending that down into the peak, into the CV input here. So this is actual audio signal going directly into the CV control on the peak. So let's initialize the patch and I'm going to send this now to the base station sign in the wavetables and I'm going to choose to have a fixed note, C minus two, it's the lowest possible note. This is just to give a bit of energy into the oscillator and then what we're going to do is we're going to modulate the oscillator volume here um, with the CV input and again we can do this via the mod matrix so let's choose the destination which is going to be oscillator one level. Let's put the depth on full there and now we need to select the source and we're going to use this as the source which is the CV input so let's go to CV plus minus. The next thing is I need to basically trigger the note so I'm going to press and lock the note on with the key latch. If you listen carefully there's going to be a very very faint um, amen break coming through here but we need to really boost this because this is really quite a hacky way of using the peak obviously the CV input isn't designed specifically for this so let's go to the voice increase the patch level we've got full volume here bring up the VCA gain here and now if I add a bit of overdrive to the sound we can hear there the amen break coming through as you can hear as I say it's a very kind of hacky sound and basically it's an incredibly low sample rate that we're working with here but what it does mean is that the audio can come in and then be processed by the effects that we have on peak. So the filter, obviously the distortions, set this to a band pass with a bit of resonance. And also we have our reverb and chorus. So you can see, even though this is a dedicated control input, we can actually also, in a hacky way, use it to send audio directly into Peak and then take advantage of the effects that we have in Peak. So, as you can see, this has been really quite an experimental approach to using the CV input on the Peak. So have a play around with this and see how you get on. And I hope it's been interesting for you to watch. Thanks very much.